Hey YouTubers, it's Suzette with Yasashi Crafts coming to you today with a small haul um, and just go over some things that I've been working on. So let's get started. Um, today I went to Joanne Fabrics and yesterday I went to Michael's and Pacatan's. But yesterday I guess I was rushing and wasn't thinking and I put everything away. So I can't re really remember everything that I purchased. Um, I know that's bad. That's sad, but I can't. Um, so I'm just going to show you what I got or what I can remember that I got. Um, Valentine's Day items were on sale at Joanne Fabrics, 50% off. So these are some felt cupcake stickers. I thought they were really, really cute. So I decided to get these. They were $3 a pack initially, 24 pieces. Um, I got two packs, $1.50 each, plus I had my... 20% off your total purchase for Joann's. Um, also at Joann's, I got the, whoops, sorry, the spaghetti string, the spaghetti strands. I got this. Um, I plan on using these with the tri beads for little girls bracelets and keychains. 35 pieces came in here, and this was about $2 in a pack. The tri beads, I got these from um, Michaels. I got these, um, I think they were like five something, if I'm not mistaken, over in a little kids section where all the beads and the different strings and things are. So I got this um, at Michaels. The other thing that um, I picked up from Michaels is some things to make jewelry to make bracelets if you remember takura gave me some um what is it the bamboo tiles well i wanted to try to make bracelets with those so i went to um michael's and i got some memory wire you see it's open sorry and i picked up some beads their beads at michael's were two for five dollars so i picked up some beads these beads here were in the kids section, but I picked up some uh, beads there, and I made a couple of bracelets yesterday, and I'll show you those. This is one here. I put this one up on my Facebook page, and yes, it was a lot of counting, and a lot of dropping of beads, and a lot of picking up. So, there's that one, and I'll put it on so you guys can see it. If you check out my Facebook page, I actually have it posted up with someone wearing it. So that's that one. It's really pretty. It's like burgundy chocolate browns and hunter green. It's really pretty. And then another one that I made is this blue one. And yes, I counted out all those sea beads and put them on. And actually, this doesn't take forever to do. You just have to be patient. And that's what it looks like. The only thing about this one I wish, all my bigger beads would have been on top. And that's why, uh, let's see if I can pick up my camera to show you guys this. That's why I bought this. I bought this here because you lay out your beads on it. Let's see. You lay out your beads on it. And you lay out your wire and your designs. And then it won't get uh, messed up. The way you lay it out is the way it should go on. So I picked that up. Ah, there we go. The next thing I picked up from uh, Joann's is this little uh, section holder for all my beads because I just didn't have anything that was um, big enough but had small enough sections in it to help with the spillage so nothing waste or anything like that so I picked one of these up I used my 40% off coupon for that and I also got these from where is it? Pack of tans. 
I picked this up because I thought I would be using it for the um, memory wire and all of that but honestly I mean they were two dollars so I'm you know it's fine that I picked them up and I like the way the nose is at the top and they were on sale for two dollars so I picked them up but honestly I have these that I have used from like the beginning of starting your sashi crafts as you can see and it has the needle nose and the wire cutter there and I got this from the dollar store and it hasn't failed me yet so got that and then I bought this because paracord um, when you do paracord uh, the bracelets or the keychains um, you're gonna want one of these because you have to burn the end um, and kids if you're doing paracord you of course you're gonna need adult supervision to use one of these um, because you would want to burn the end so let me say that so I picked up one of these it was 99 cents and I believe that is it um, hopefully I'll have some more bracelets to show you guys on Monday um, I'll be doing a duct tape pin flower pin tutorial but if somebody can let me know how to edit to uh, pick up the pace of the video make it go a little faster because when I'm cutting and folding and putting the petals on that takes forever and I would like to kind of go through certain parts of it pretty fast so if you could let me know in the comments section how to do that I would appreciate it alrighty guys um, don't forget to rate comment and subscribe um, inbox me if you have any questions or if you'd like to make a purchase don't forget to check me out on Facebook Twitter and Etsy and Instagram um, God bless have a wonderful day. See you guys later. Bye.